Making it to a state final is a big deal for the players and coaches, but the effect on the people in the community is sometimes even greater. Virtually the entire town of Crestview is in Columbus today to cheer on the Knights, including a fan who has been watching Crestview basketball for five decades. I graduated back in 1965. J.R. Dawson has waited a long time to see a Crestview basketball state title, but this year was special from the start. Uh, we want to go one step further, and uh, I hope this is a magical year that we that, that get it all done this time. Crestview track and field coach James Lassenheiser drove JR down to Columbus. There was no way that Dawson was going to miss the biggest game in over a decade. JR is one of Crestview's top fans of all time, and if, and if he wasn't going to be here, it wouldn't be worth it. He's as much as this team and our programs as anybody else, and we're glad he could be here to celebrate. JR helps out with stats at Crestview games during the season and often sits with the students. He was right behind the students at the shot, and the atmosphere was exactly what he was hoping for. It, it let it all, and I, I think everybody would be jacked up. This community is definitely down here. I think Van Wert County on our side, Wren and Convoy, and, and everything in between is probably pretty empty today. We're in Columbus. Dawson doesn't hesitate to rank this year's group with the best in program history. It, it has to be, has, obviously, it has to be the best for what they accomplished in a tougher schedule they had, but playing at D3 schools and bigger schools uh, as such. Feels like a little bit of unfinished business. They've heard stories from 1971 team uh, that he remembers. They've heard stories from the 2003 team that I remember when it came through. Now you can add the 2014 team to that list. State champs and an undefeated season. You can bet JR will remember today for his next five decades of Crestview basketball. In Columbus, I'm Matt Finkel for the Sports Report.